tax season is here, but so are the scammers. Let's dive into the top 10 tax refund scams that you need to watch out for to keep your money and identity safe. Number one, phishing emails asking to verify information. Scammers love to send phishing emails posing as the IRS. They'll demand urgent payment or verification. Remember, the IRS won't email you. Check the sender's address and never click on suspicious links. Phone calls demanding money. Definitely be aware of scam calls claiming that you owe money. They might threaten arrest or demand payment straight away. Always ask for a reference number. Then you hang up and you call the official IRS to confirm. Number three, you discover a tax return filed under your name. Imagine finding out somebody filled a tax return in your name. Best thing to do, set up an identity protection pin with the IRS. This gives you added security. Don't let thieves mess with your hard earned refund. Number four, claiming your social security number has been suspended. Don't fall for the SSN suspension scam. Your social security number can't be suspended. If someone claims otherwise, it's a scam. Protect your SSN and report suspicious activity. Number five, watch out for ghost tax preparers. Only share your info with verified professionals. When in doubt, you can ask for their IRS PTIN, which means preparer tax identification number, or you can find them in the official IRS directory. Six, ignore emails demanding additional tax forms. The IRS won't contact you via email. Report the fraud and steer clear of sharing sensitive information online. Number seven, you get notified that the IRS owes you an extra refund. Don't get tricked by emails claiming extra refunds. This one's pretty cool. You can actually use the IRS where's my refund tool and this will give you the accurate information. Again, stay cautious and avoid clicking those extra links. Eight, overdue stimulus payments or unemployment benefits. This is another thing that the IRS just won't email you about. You can check your benefits directly through your IRS account. Number nine, a call from a tax agency other than the IRS. Scammers like to pretend to be fake agencies. I mean, they'll pretend almost anything. Don't trust unsolicited calls. Simple way to handle this kind of thing is ask for a reference number, hang up, and then you go and verify through official channels. Number 10, we've got the overdue payment scam. You receive a call, they demand extra payment. Oh, but all of a sudden they wanna be paid in gift cards and cryptocurrency. There's a reason they're asking you to be paid in untraceable methods. It's because they want to be untraceable and they're a scam. The IRS simply won't ask you to pay in gift cards or cryptocurrency. There you have it, TikTok. Be vigilant, protect your personal info and report any suspicious activity. And that's how you stay one step ahead of the scammers this tax season.